Hey everyone, welcome to the Gastro Girl YouTube channel. I'm Jacqueline Gollin and we're here to bring you the best information, resources and experts to help you understand and optimize your digestive health. There's about one in four people who are living with a chronic digestive health condition. These could include acid reflux, IBS, IBD, chronic stomach and ab pain, but there's a lot of people who haven't gotten a diagnosis and are struggling with symptoms and they've been struggling with symptoms for years and years. And sometimes we don't know what to make of it. We think it's normal, but it doesn't have to be normal. Now, while the information in all of our video podcasts are evidence-based and led by experts in gastroenterology, as well as patients who are living with various digestive health conditions. The information that you'll find here is not medical advice, but it is information that you can take to your healthcare provider to help you ask better questions. Doctors and healthcare providers really need your help as a patient to better understand the symptoms you're experiencing so that they can diagnose you accurately and quicker so that you get the treatment and help you need to feel better. Take a look at some of our highlights so you can get a feel for some of the topics and guests that we've had on previous shows. If we detect cancer early, which we do all the time, yeah. we can have 90% cure rates, which is unbelievable. You don't think of cancer and cure all the time, right? Oh boy. <laughs> I know, I know. And as a female gastroenterologist, Jackie, I have to tell you, this is the number one symptom uh, complaint that I get. In my mind, food was like not a source of energy. It was a, a source of struggle and, and, and pain and confusion. I was told all sorts of things. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, you must be depressed. Oh, you've been through so much. Of course, you know, you're gonna feel this way. No, there's something really wrong with me. And we know that when you look at patients who have obesity, the risk of acid reflux is twice of that of patients with normal weight. It's not normal to have food stink. It's not normal to have food lodge like that and having to, you know, vomit or upchuck. It, it's not normal. It brings up a lot of questions like oh. how, how we enroll patients, what is our responsibility, what are the barriers that we need to address. We're also open to new ideas. So if you have a question or a digestive health topic that you'd like to see covered, you can email us at podcast at gastrogirl.com. So if you crave the inside scoop on the latest news, research, and resources related to gastroenterology and want it all delivered in an engaging, friendly, non-judgmental, educational way that features leading GI experts, inspiring patients, and positive vibes, this podcast series is for you.